Hello. Um, this time in this tutorial, I'm going to show as a continuation from the Aladdin Magic plugin that I've been doing this last two weeks. Is able to introduce a sub tab to a present window of the ERP. In this case, it's a sales order, and we will be able to just inject a new tab into the whole row of tabs on the fly okay but that's not all that's very quickly and it'll be over in a minute but i want to show something i just did yesterday which is an online uh, translator api uh, which i've now incorporated into the code and it will be able to give you your local translation also on the fly wouldn't that be great so that in the end, we will have the uh, sales order having it fully translated. Okay, let's get on with it. Let's log in into your um, item here, and you have your own local uh, language. So in this case, this is um, Spanish. Spanish, yes. But we will first uh, define it in English, and when it comes to the translation part, we will we log in in the local language. So you work for any of your local language from Chinese to Russian, to Japanese, to Vietnamese, to Malay, to Indonesian, Turkish, German, French, of course, I've added in a few more languages and I will add if your language is not uh, included. Now first, um, we have to make the um, validation rule of the pull down to allow um, the sales order. So um, go to the validation rule of AD table for user defined, which I did here, and change this MY to C. So now you allow C order type of files. Save it. Now go to that window that defines subtemp, the model designer. Um, now this is your subtemp. Um, now you can call sales order. 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 All right. So you introduce a new subtemp here. You have to click on this and you're not going to generate any model code anyway for this. Just save it. One, two, that's it less than three seconds you will have it as a sub tab but first uh, let us add some fields into it go into the new window you have to put the name of your new sub tab which is uh, accessories to here and this is just a test case just to uh, get everything in and uh, just as a proof of concept okay save it and you have populated your sub tab so now we're going to change its language. So we have to now log out. Uh, get back in in your local language. Then uh, call back your um, main table. And this time check this back out. We don't need to create another new master detail, but this is a, a temporal holder for making the translation. So it will take some time because it's going through all the tabs. Now it is intelligent. It will not retranslate the other tabs that are already there. You only translate for the new tab, which is the accessory tab. So once this has finished, we will go in into the garden admin uh, to see it already translated on the fly. Okay, this should have been done. Let us uh, change our role. Go to garden admin. Remember, this will work for your local languages. Uh, there are a lot of it. Uh, I'll show you in a while to check the uh, forum to see the list of languages there. If your language is not in there, just inform me, I'll update it. 
Okay, let's go to the sales order, which we have introduced a new tab, an accessory tab. Here it is. Okay, here it is. Everything there. Let's see if it works in something. Standard order. <laughs> let's have a customer. So now we can come to your new tab and start entering data. As you can see, everything is translated into Spanish. Really on the fly, very fast and very powerful. Okay, so this is a proof of concept that it really works. Okay, then um, let me show you the forum as I promised you. Um, here is the uh, list of uh, languages that is covered. Right. If your language is not in here, originally Chinese was not defined there, but I put it in, and uh, so it was my language, uh, Malay, and also a neighboring country, Indonesian. I put that in. And since I recently visited Vietnam, it wasn't in and Thai, so I put this both into. Okay, then. Have a nice day. Bye bye.